Gather the supplies necessary for nasogastric intubation. Have the patient breathe deeply through each nostril while occluding the other nostril. Select the more patent side. Wind the distal end of the tube around your index finger. This will bend the tube into a curve similar to the course through the nasal pharynx. Immersion of the tube in ice water will give it additional rigidity. Measure the distance of ideal insertion by stretching the tube from the tip of the nose to the tip of the earlobe and from there to the end of the xiphoid process. This is commonly referred to as the nose ear xiphoid or nex measurement. Mark the tube with tape at the desired level of insertion. Give the patient a cup of water with a straw. Instruct him to take sips during intubation to facilitate tube passage into the esophagus. Apply lidocaine jelly to the tube tip. Intubate the more patent nostril, directing the tube horizontally along the floor of the nose. Have the patient flex his chin to his chest and sip water to aid in passage of the tube through the oropharynx into the esophagus. Advance the tube to the desired level of insertion while the patient continues to sip water. Draw some air into a catheter tip syringe and connect it to the sump port of the tube. Auscultate the epigastrium while injecting air to check tube placement. Note the tube position should also be confirmed radiographically. Secure the tube to the nose with paper tape by wrapping from behind and crossing over the front of the tube and then crisscrossing the nose. After the tube is secure at the nose, pin it to the gown at the level of the sternum. 